In the previous sections, we have completed uh, all the customizing settings uh, uh, that we required for a new company code. Actually, that was the first step to create the company code. Then we went to some of the most important settings uh, for the in customizing for that particular new company code. Then we have also checked a lot of uh, things that have to do with the customizing of master records and the creation of these master records. And now we want to test this all. And well, this is going to be really interesting because we are connected to SAP log um, in the Fiori Launchpad. And uh, especially for people who have been using the system for a long time, this is going to be really interesting because this app is very nice. It's uh, the way in which it was uh, designed. Uh, a lot of people agree that it's a really nice uh, interface. And it's just because it's very useful. It's not just because it's nice uh, to the eye, but it's also really uh, good to use this. So let's start this is the post general journal entries app. And it's going to be a very simple, it's a simple document because, um, well, we are assuming that we, in the real world, we have withdrawn money from one of our banks. And we just want the, to have this money as petty cash to pay small expenses, you know, such as tips for a messenger boy or a, maybe a taxi or maybe flowers for the office. I mean, small expenses. So, well, first let's start with the journal entry date. We'll select the same day as the posting date. Now, for this particular uh, the kind of scenario, we didn't uh, create a new uh, journal entry type, I mean, like a document uh, type. So we'll just use the standard one, which is the SA. Now we need to set up correctly the ID for our company code. And well, the currency is correct. So just to update the screen, let's uh, press enter uh, in our keyboard. We have now everything correct here. And we will start with the petty cash account. So we have the correct ID now. And uh, well, for this, we will have a debit which will be for, let's say, uh, 3,000 euros. Now, as we have been saying, the, the app has been designed uh, in a very elegant way. So the way uh, to get access to the details of this first line item is coming all the way to the left. And we have to click here the expand collapse because this uh, will open the detail and give us access to the profit center field. So we will uh, use a profit center that we have available in this server for this particular uh, company code. So well, after we have entered that, we can close this uh, the detail section for this first line item. And now we can start with the second item. So it's really quick. We get to the uh, second item and let's enter the bank account. Now, uh, uh, as you can see, uh, for the first line item, we use the debit uh, field. Actually, that is the reason we have a balance right now, because we don't have anything in, on the credit side uh, as, as of right now. But that is the next step. We'll just enter the amount and hit enter in the keyboard. Okay. Uh, as you can see, uh, now the total balance uh, has been uh, reset to zero and it's actually green because that means that we have a, ba a zero balance document. So we can now post. Let's uh, proceed uh, for that uh, at the bottom right corner. We have post. And as you can see, the document was created successfully. So that is very good news. <laughs> uh, it's real good because that means uh, all the past settings uh, were correct, all of our customizing and, and uh, all, even the master records, they were like, or they are correct. So actually we can display the document. Uh, so we can just click here, display, just to double check that everything is correct. And yes, uh, as you can see, the document was created correctly. We have all the header data here at the top, things as the, such as the dates, the company code, of course, the transaction currency, the journal entry type that we also call this the document type and of course the uh, data for the user but importantly of course it's uh, uh, that we have here at the bottom or middle section the line items so yes we have a debit to the petty cash and a credit to the bank account 
So well, after we have seen this, uh, uh, um, uh, as you can probably agree with us, it's uh, uh, great news because all of our previous settings were correctly, uh, we correctly set everything up. So now we can just uh, finish this lesson. But of course, we invite you to keep learning with some of the next uh, ones in which we'll even test uh, other settings. So uh, thank you for the time being and we'll see you there.